The fourth summit of conference on interaction and confidence building measures in Asia, also known as SICA, opens this week in Shanghai. And the city is now beefing up security everywhere. CCTV's Shi Wing Jing has more from Shanghai. This is one of the city's first emergency units. They are charged with keeping the city safe, and their first mission is to provide security during the upcoming summit. The car is equipped with all the equipment we need to handle an emergency, including helmets, batons, body armor, and riot shields. The number of emergency units depends on the scale and demand of each district. This district has nine units. We work from 8 a.m. to 12 midnight. Apart from all these equipment, there's something special about the car. As we can tell, there's a camera on top of the vehicle. If anything emergency happens, the camera can send back real-time pictures to the command center as soon as police officer arrive at the scene. Along with the special units, armed police have been stationed on the most crowded streets. Chen Songyi and Wang Defen are patrol partners, and bus stations are their key guard areas. Since April the 20th, more than 1,000 patrol officers have been certified to carry 9mm revolvers. Previously, local police worked their beats without firearms. The tightened security is welcomed by local residents. <laughs> I've noticed the frequent police patrols. I can only assume the summit is very important. I think it's very necessary. I learned from the news that all public transportation now requires a security check. Checks on subways help guarantee the safety of civilians. I think the security work for this summit is very good. I feel very proud that the summit is being held in China. I'm very happy. Local residents, the summit also means an extra day off. Preparations for the summit are entering into the final stages, and the city appears ready to go. Shunjin, CCTV, Shanghai.